Well, our weather is going to continue to stay nice and dry for one more day. So tomorrow is the day. Get out, take the dog on a walk and enjoy the afternoon because it's really going to be the afternoon where we're going to see likely the biggest difference for us as we head through the rest of this week. We'll be in the low 60s when we wake up tomorrow morning. Lots of sunshine all day long. Temperatures reach the mid 80s by the afternoon. If you need out, need to get out, maybe do some mowing, last minute mowing. Wednesday is a great day to do it. Thursday morning is also going to be a good option there as well. Friday and Saturday mornings also should be on the good quieter side of things, but obviously if it rains the day before could cause some issues with your lawnmower, especially with how saturated that that grass already is. Things are nice and quiet for us here, but out to the west, we've had this line of storms kind of moving from west to east since pretty much yesterday where we had some uh, severe weather in portions of Colorado as well as Kansas. Tonight we've seen that severe weather in Iowa, Wisconsin, Illinois, as well as even into uh, portions of Arkansas and Oklahoma and Missouri there. So that's going to continue to track off to the east. As far as where that's going to end up, though, it is going to continue to bring some severe weather through the rest of tonight and into tomorrow morning, as well as the potential for uh, some severe weather again into tomorrow throughout the day tomorrow. So you can see that stretch moves a little bit further off to the east and uh, is still stretching all the way from pretty much northern parts of the country down all the way down to the south. As that finally makes its way east to the triad, we're not talking any severe weather here. Could still see a strong storm or two with the rain that's going to be arriving on Thursday, but that severe weather threat, that level one risk is going to be off into portions of Virginia, Maryland, New Jersey, and then off into the northeast. Again, that potential for us does arrive, though, on Thursday, and it's still part of that same system. It's just going to be on the uh, much weaker side for us, and we're not talking severe weather there. Nice and dry in the morning on Thursday. No issues for the morning commute, but it's the afternoon commute when that line of storms starts to try and form. We're talking scattered storms through the afternoon and evening on Thursday, and then we'll hold on to that potential for some rain chances into Friday, as well as again into Saturday, Sunday, and we move into that summertime pattern with those pop-up afternoon thunderstorms, and we're talking scattered storms, especially in the afternoon and evening there. Temperatures will be in the mid-80s as well. We're going to sound like a broken record. This is almost a copy-paste forecast. Mid-60s in the morning, mid-80s in the afternoon, a 40 to 50 percent chance for some scattered storms all the way as we head into your Memorial Day as well as even into the start of next week.